let's look at question number 20 consider the following state for consider the following aerosols foaming agents fire retardants lubricants in the making of how many of these uh, how many of the above are hydrofluorocarbons hfcs used for right hydrofluorocarbons or hfcs used for so it is fairly obvious that this question is there because it is quite you know understandable that hfcs are something which are you know a very important chemicals these days in terms of current affairs in terms of global warming i hope you all understand hfcs are part of the kigali amendment of the montreal protocol right kigali amendment to the montreal protocol hfc are also part of the united nations framework convention on climate change as a potential greenhouse gas right and you guys know that india is already you know in a process of phasing out in fact the world is already in a process of phasing out hfc so it's fairly obvious a question on hfc is asked so this is somewhat relatable to the ongoing issues ongoing uh, popular uh, issues there, there so we can relate it with current affairs we can also relate it with the topics of climate change right so in how many of these above uh, you know uh, products hfc is used in their making so let me tell you aerosols aerosols basically salts are nothing but colloidal solutions right so aerosols are those kind of colloidal solutions which are suspended in air so hfc is a very popular organic solvent which is often used in aerosol spray so most of these aerosol spray that we see around us in the form of deodorants in the form of room fresheners they often come mixed with hfc which enables them to spray the entire chemicals easily and remain suspended in the air for a longer period right so aerosol spray yes this is definitely one of the areas where hfc are used for foaming agents yes hfc for the same purpose it can be used as a foaming agent also you can mix any kind of organic chemicals here and you can eventually use them to create foam and otherwise similar kind of substances fire retardants again for the same activity for the same properties aerosols foaming agents fire retardants they are often used you know they are often made uh, with hfc being mixed in it but when it comes to lubricants See, lubricants are basically used in places to avoid friction, right? In places to, you know, in places to reduce friction, in mostly to cool down the substance when they were when there are two machine parts striking or you know uh, creating friction around each other. So lubricants are mostly used in that case. There is no such scientific proof as in for now that lubricants are needed or HFC is needed to prepare or to make lubricants. Most of the lubricants that we see around us, they do not use HFC. Most of them, they are organically produced. Some of them are industrial organic compounds. Some of them are naturally, naturally occurring organic compounds. But we haven't found any specific evidence that suggests that HFCs are primarily used for making lubricants. So I would suggest that the fourth particular point is incorrect. And that is why the answer to this question, it's a straight away factual answer. It is only three, right? Option C.